Fox 5 News This Morning with Heidi Hayes, Dave Hall, and Fox 5 Weather 24-7 with meteorologist Ted Britton. Fox 5 News This Morning, local Las Vegas. Hey everybody, welcome back. 623, the Leave it to Beaver model of motherhood is changing yes. and it's changing fast. So today, in anticipation of Mother's Day, we are honoring all types of moms. Fox 5's Lauren Murphy Excellent. spoke with one woman who is doing it her way She's and it's different. Very, very <laughs> different. She asked the question, do you need a man to raise a great kid? Well, she doesn't think so. And she says the little man in her life is more than enough. Did I have the time to, to get in another relationship and go through all of that? not knowing if it was gonna to lead to children or not. No, Paula decided, but that didn't stop her from becoming a mother. She could do it on her own. I had mixed reactions. Uh, a lot of them were like, good for you, go for it. Uh, some not so, <laughs> not so supportive. That was two and a half years ago. What's a dog do? What's a cat do? Blonde, blue-eyed Aiden is now in the throes of the terrible twos. Overall, he is a fantastic kid. He, the love of my life. Is there a void? Do you feel there's a void in your family at all? No, definitely not. But Paula admits something was missing. No, not a man. She's pregnant with her second child, a little girl, using the same donor she used with Aiden. What's Carol doing again? Yeah. People are starting to realize, you know, I can't keep waiting forever. I can't wait to find the right person. I want to have a child now. Dr. Joseph Adeshek is seeing patients like Paula much more often. No, I'm not here to judge. There's great parents, great mothers out there, and there's some not so great mothers out there. And whether they're a single mom or they're married, I don't think that makes any difference whatsoever. And Paula wouldn't have it any other way. My son is the best thing I've ever done, um, my newest addition. I'll never regret having my kids. Good However, job. I feel had I not had them, I would have regretted that. Paula says she's not at all opposed to a little more testosterone in the house. <laughs> but any man who joins her clan should know that this is a package deal. Yeah, so she, it was just getting later in life, and mm -hmm. she wanted children, and sure. this is why she decided to and, do this. And yeah, and she she said she would have done it sooner. Mm -hmm. Wow, well, good for her. It's an she option means, a lot more women are mm -hmm. using. That's now what I'm hearing. Doctor said that's what mm -hmm. they're seeing a lot more of. Yeah. Wow. Okay, great stories once Thanks, again. Lauren. Thank you, Lauren. All right, six twenty-five. Speaking of moms, mm -hmm. mommy carried you for nine months. Labor pains, poo-poo, preschool prom, and you still haven't bought her a Mother's Day gift. Feel guilty yet?